Daddy, have you ever experienced racism? Yep, I have. Have you? I think so. Really? And how did that make you feel? Horrible, because I was confused and I didn't understand that it was such a big deal that my skin was different. I mean, honestly, it doesn't. But people make it a way bigger deal than what it should be. So once you got a good heart, you do good things for people, you live a life that's fulfilling to your purpose, your skin color really shouldn't matter. But unfortunately, it does. I just don't understand why someone wouldn't like me because of my skin color. I'm still the same person. You got a little accent there, huh? But the unfortunate part about it is that through life, you're going to experience more of that, right? But the important thing that you do is you teach people not to hate. I will after I shake them like this. You want a piece of me, huh? You want a piece of me? You want a piece of Big C? Now hold on, Big C, I hear you. But let's just bring awareness to it and remind the world to be kind. Okay, because they don't know about Big C, Daddy. I don't play. Yeah, okay, calm down. Is everything good? You know what, Mama, it's not. A few kids in my school don't like me because of my skin color. Now we're gonna shake them, but Daddy insists that I just bring awareness. They don't like my baby? Oh no, where's my kids? Hey, but calm down. You worse than Big C. <sighs> you're right. Coco, your dad is right. Some kids just don't know better, and a lot of times they have those behaviors because of what their parents taught them. It would be very heroic of you to teach people that your skin color shouldn't matter, but being a good person does. So, so now you're gonna sign with daddy? I thought you was a real one. Coco. I'm just playing, daddy. I'm just playing. I understand. You know what I'm about to do? I'm about to go teach these little snot-nosed kids something.